Hi, I'm Andrew Tate and I play the double bass with our West Australian Symphony Orchestra. When I'm not performing, I'm here in my workshop building, restoring and repairing fine stringed instruments. A person who does this is called a luthier. Uh, you can find many of my instruments in our orchestra. I have four projects on the go at the moment. The first and most urgent is this lovely old Italian violin, uh, which has, as you can see, the fingerboard resting on the belly because the neck has given way. The reason that's urgent is because it belongs to one of our exceptionally hard-working and talented first violinists and she feels all at sea without her violin. Most professional musicians have a special attachment to their in particular instrument. Second and third projects are these two gorgeous old double basses which are in pieces behind me. The one lying down is an Italian instrument possibly built in the workshop of the Galliano family and I would estimate around about 250 years old. The double bass sitting upright here is um, a wonderful example of the English double bass making school. It was built in around about 1830 uh, by the um, Fent family. And the fourth project that I have on the go is, I don't know if you can see, but the plans up here are of a viola de gamba, which um, the original was 400 years old. So I'm copying that instrument. Now I've been lucky enough to have studied with a fine luthier in London by the name of Roger Dawson. Not only a wonderful teacher, but an amazing luthier himself. And he built this double bass for me, uh, which is a copy of a Gaspar de Salo, which was, the original was 400 years old. I take great satisfaction in my role within the music community, both locally and internationally. Having studied with Roger, who continues a cultural heritage that could be traced back to 1715, I'm very proud to be able to pass that on to aspiring luthiers on this side of the planet and regularly do so in Australia and New Zealand. So thanks for watching and I hope to see you at one of our concerts in the near future. Bye for now.